What's up everybody, it's a boy meme here. Uh, for breakfast, I had a smoothie. For lunch, I had a, <laughs> I had a hamburger. Uh, like, no, I had a cheeseburger and uh, uh, Coca-Cola and uh, a bag of Cheetos, a small bag of Cheetos. Uh, and uh, for dinner, we might be having BLTs, I think. Um, today was stressful. Today at work was stressful. Cause I didn't work today. Today was kid day. Um, and I don't, okay. I was paid technically, but, um, it was, it was just, it was very stressful and it sucked. Um, uh, a lot of s staff br brought in their kids. Okay. So the reason why it was stressful for me is because I was, um, my, my, it's my mom's job to do stuff like kid day. And so I was helping my mom. Um, and I say she's a receptionist. That's just an easy way to say that she like plans events for people. I, I what, what am I supposed to say? Event planner. She's an event, but she doesn't only do event planning. You know, she she does other. I don't. I don't. I don't really know what her job. Um, but she she does stuff like um like kid day, and um, you know um. Uh. Yeah, so, um, oh my god, uh, yeah, so that's the reason why I was helping her, and, uh, it was generally pretty stressful. The first, like, few hours of the day, I was actually just organizing stuff. Um, I started doing this new cup system, uh, because the table itself that I was sorting the drawers with, um, the table itself has gone very disorganized and dirty, um, and there's a whole bunch of, like, it's because I, I would go through a drawer and I there would be a lot of like one-off items in there and uh, when I realize that there's no repeated items in it, I'd just be like, oh, I'll place that on the table. Uh, but that's happened so many times that there's just a whole bunch of random stuff on the table. Um, but the nice thing is, is that those one-off items uh, ended up not being one-off items because they were just in like a different drawer. Um, so the thing I'm doing is I have uh, a bunch of big cups, like big solo cups, and a bunch of like small like Dixie cups. Uh, um, and is that what that is? Okay, yeah. Uh, some a bunch of small little Dixie cups, and uh, yeah, uh, I basically just get each cup and I put the object into the cup, right? So I, I just put if an object is like a like I put all same objects into the into each cup. So like if there are fifty of like some screw, I'd put it in one cup. Um, and if there are two of like a valve, I put it in one cup. Uh, but you know, depending on the size, I would, um, I think, depending on the size, I would, uh, uh, depending on the size of the object would, would change what the size of the cup is that I use. <laughs> I don't know why that took me so long to explain. Um, and, uh, yeah. Uh, then after that, I had to help my mom with kid day, and um, it kind of sucked because um, we were moving stuff out to the table, um, and I was very stressed out about the concept of people walking up to the table and then th them grabbing stuff inefficiently. Um, it like had really freaked me out. So, like, like for example, like there was salad. Okay, so there was like. There was salad at one of the end of the table, and there were these plates, and they had tomatoes and onions and lettuce on them. And I was like, oh, these are all vegetables. They should go on this one side of the table, right? And um, then, you know, I did put the hamburgers and the hamburger buns and the hot dogs and the hot dog buns on one side of the table. I put, like, condiments and stuff, and then I put, like, some other things. And, you know, my mom told me to not worry because she would sort it out, but I would worry that she wouldn't she didn't have the vision that I had. You know, I, I was worried that she wasn't properly worried about, it. like this concept of this table wasn't taking up enough space in her head. So I was worried that she would, that maybe everything wouldn't be accounted for. And you know, that's a, that's a bad thing to think, right? Because it's her, it's her job, right? But I was very spooked and I wasn't in the right headspace. Um, and it turns out, and proof of me not being in the right headspace is that turns out 
those tomatoes and onions and lettuce that I had put to the salad that I mentioned earlier uh, were actually for the burgers. And so they were meant to go on the other side of the table and just, you know, that had really stressed me out. And like, I was really, like, I was really worried about having, um, so th there would be like things like with, <laughs> I sound like a crazy person, I'm sorry. Um, uh, there are these things with, so the per, I was also really stressed out about whether or not the openings for the ha ha like cheeseburger buns should be facing the griller or facing away from the griller. Uh, because facing away from the griller would imply that people should grab the hamburger buns, uh, the cheeseburger buns, but facing toward the hamburger, impl uh, facing toward the griller implies that, um, the person grilling will end up putting the cheeseburger bun on the grill. And my mom was insisting that it would be facing away, uh, so then, no, that it would be facing toward the griller, um, because, um, and then, like, the person grilling would put it on the bun, but I don't know. I've, I've never really been to a barbecue where that's the case. Um, so th that had, that was very strange to me. Uh, cause typically, you know, the barbecuer places the things onto like an object, like a hot object, and then they stay warm. Uh, and then people could just grab the buns and then put the meat on the bun. Uh, and that's, that's how I always had it. But I, I don't know. Um, also, um, a thing that had stressed me out was, um, the sodas were in the middle of the table and the cheeseburgers were on the side of the table as the griller. Like, not the cheeseburger, the cheeseburger buns were on the same side of the table as the griller. And it went, uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, it, <laughs> this is so bad. It went, um, so there's the table, right? And it, and the grill is here and the griller's here. And it went hamburger buns, right? And hot dog buns, soda cans, and then the salad. But I was very, very, very worried that people would get their hamburgers and then get their sodas and then they would have to place their sodas back down on the table, right? And then put their stuff back on the burger and then put their stuff back on, grab the soda and go. And that was horrifying because it would be way more efficient if you could just put the condiment stuff in the middle and then have the drinks at the end. So then people could just grab their drinks as they go and then the line would go way faster. And that, you know, that table really freaked me out. And, you know, I, I was just, I was just kind of put in a, like a, in a weird mood. Um, but, um, uh, you know, other than that, what, what, once that whole debacle was over and once the barbecue was actually happening, it went okay. Um, me and my coworker meant to have a sort of hydraulic cannon to entertain um, the kids. Um, not a hydraulic cannon. Like a, like, not hydraulics. Like a, like a, cannon with air pressure. We use air pressure for the cannon. Why'd I say hydraulic? What other cannon? What cannon uses anything other than... I'm sorry. I've met... Okay. Anyway. Okay. Anyway. Uh, so we, we have this cannon with air pressure and, um, uh, you know, and it would shoot these balls toward this, these ships that we painted black. Um, and that's what the plan was. But me and him were trying it out. We were turning up the pressure and everything. And it went, <laughs> like, it, like, like really loudly, right? Um, and, you know, uh, it really freaked me out, right? And I was, uh, you know, I was freaked out, right? Um, and because, you know, when, when messing with, uh, like, stuff with air pressure and then you hear a big boom, it freaks you out. Uh, really, there was only, like, 40 pounds of pressure and it the air compressor was set to where it could only do 40 pounds of pressure. But, you know, when you're doing uh, stuff with an air compressor and then you hear a loud sound that you didn't expect, it, it, you know, it, it freaks you out. You're kind of, you know, it, it freaks you out. And, uh, you know, I was right near the ground. I was looking at the air gauge. Luckily, nothing had happened. But um, the sort of tank that holds the compressed air, um, it was attached to this pipe. And, uh, there was sort of, there must have been some glue, but there wasn't, like, very much. Um, and as it was rattling, bringing it out to the, um, to the, like, we rolled it onto the, across the parking lot to the barbecue, as we were rolling it, uh, it probably disconnected a little bit the, the pipe to the, to the cannon. 
Um, but yeah, man, with stuff like, with videos like this, I should just like write out a list of things to talk about because like that would make it so much better than just having a 10 minute video that sucks, you know? And that's, and that's what this is. And, uh, you know, I'm going to have to title this like, like very badly explaining a barbecue or something, you know, I'm, and I'm fine with that. I've done that before. Uh, but it's, it's just bothersome. Maybe I should write stuff down. Uh, I forget to, I, you know, my, my days are typically very uneventful, right? Um, so I have nothing to talk about, but, and so I write nothing down, but in the days where I do have something to talk about, I think, oh, um, I need to, in, in the day, in, in the days in which I do have something to talk about, I think, oh, um, I should, uh, I should hit record and I don't have to write anything down because I never write anything down. I, I never have to write anything down when I'm recording my videos, right? And, uh, you know, I think I forget that the am amount of things I did in the day are different. So, yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. I think that's it. I'm sorry. Um. Yeah, this, this is horrifying. This is a horrifying video. Um, if this is the first video you watched from me, I'm sorry. Um, but, you know, it's 11 minutes now, and I can't record another 11-minute video, because that would take too long, and I have to exercise. So, yeah, I don't know. Um, and I think my parents might be home. Wait. No. Um, okay, all right, see you, dude. <laughs>